I simply had to weigh in on the whole brouhaha surrounding this senior in Colorado, a girl who submitted her yearbook photo, like we all do, but it was a full length shot of her like in this mini skirt with a bare midriff. And it's not so much that, that's the problem. I'm not, I wanna come across as a prude here, but it's, it's the appropriateness of it. They said, and this is a point that people are forgetting, the yearbook staff, from what I understand, said that she could have that photo in the yearbook somewhere else in the yearbook, but not as her official senior photo. You know how rows of people, because that's a headshot. I mean, and then she came out saying, well, it's my interest to be a model, and so that's why I wanted to do this full-length shot. And other people show their guitars and everything. Well, no, I've never seen that in someone's official yearbook photo. I've seen headshots. That's it. Because then, if we all have different things, you know, I don't know, tambourines, guitars, whatever, it looks really mishmash. That's for other areas of the yearbook, like if you're in band or you're in the modeling club, whatever, then you show those types of photos. And that's what they're telling her. She can show her photos, just not as her official yearbook photo. And I totally agree with that. It's not like they're banning it. That's what I understand, and that's what I read. They're not banning those shots, just not in the alphabetical section where your senior photo is. So I get that. I really do, because... And I look back at my yearbook, it's a headshot. Everyone had a headshot. Everyone looked the same. We all looked really strange looking back, but that's the way it's supposed to be. And that's protocol. And so, you know what? I totally agree with the school and the yearbook staff. And I think this girl and her mother should get over it. 